Hey everyone. Welcome back to my channel Mohammed Mamaris. Today, we're diving into the fascinating story of Chester Floyd Carlson, the brilliant mind behind a revolutionary invention that has become an integral part of our daily lives, electrophotography. So, grab your popcorn, hit that like button, and let's jump right into the incredible journey of Chester Carlson. Before we get into the nitty-gritty of electrophotography, let's talk a bit about the man himself. Chester Carlson was born on February 8, 1906, in Seattle, Washington. Growing up, he showed an early interest in science and technology, a passion that would eventually lead him to change the way we duplicate documents forever. Fast forward to the 1930s, Carlson was working as a patent attorney, and the tedious task of copying documents inspired him to find a better way. You see, back in the day, copying documents was a time-consuming and messy process involving carbon paper and chemicals. Carlson dreamed of a simpler, cleaner method. After years of experimentation and dedication, Carlson finally hit the jackpot in 1938. He came up with the concept of electrophotography, a process that involved creating dry copies of documents using static electricity, light, and photoconductive material. In simpler terms, he laid the foundation for what we now know as photocopying. Now, you'd think that Carlson's groundbreaking invention would be embraced immediately. Right? Well, not quite. Carlson faced numerous challenges convincing companies to invest in his idea. It took several years before the Haloid Company, which later became Xerox Corporation, saw the potential and partnered with Carlson to bring his invention to the masses. The first commercial photocopier, the Xerox 914, hit the market in 1959, forever changing the landscape of document reproduction. Carlson's invention not only made office life more efficient but also laid the groundwork for the modern photocopying industry. And there you have it, the incredible story of Chester Floyd Carlson, the man who gave us the gift of electrophotography. If you enjoyed this journey through history, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, hit subscribe for more fascinating stories, and let me know in the comments which inventor or invention you'd like me to cover next. Until next time, keep exploring the wonders of the past, present, and future. This is Mohammed Mamaris, signing off.